Welcome back to Thy Night Blaze, Xenoblade Chronicles 3. I have to start off by saying I'm sorry for the last episode, the, auto qu the audio quality, it was shot, it was destroyed. I looked into it. Hopefully, I figured out what went wrong and everything sounds better for the rest of forever. I think I solved the issue. I just had to lower the maximum volume of both my microphone and the Elgato in my computer settings just a bit. So hopefully peaking audio doesn't destroy everything if it does i'm going to cry because that one was a pain to edit hopefully you guys just watch the cutscenes and nothing else because nothing else important happened on this episode we're going to talk to gondor and sugu they've been making us work the whole time we've been locked up in here what's more agnes uses the stuff that we produce to carry on their war if something that i made hurt one of my family back in the city i don't know what i'd do Living with that anxiety for so many years, it's enough to send you crazy. We've made some new friends. I, 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 is it enough to make friends in prison? It's like, it's like maybe you might be able to make friends in prison. I do want to talk to a lot of uh, people in here. <laughs> major, not not major. It's it is the least major spoilers one could ever ever encounter in video. It's like super minor spoilers. We won't always be able to talk to these people because they'll. Go away. Your cell's not this way. You better get back before the guards start giving us all an Great earache. Did I see Shania? I did see Shania. Hello, Shania. No one wants to be trapped in this cesspit, slaving the rest of their lives away. I want to get out of here as soon as possible, and I dare say you do as well. You are not incorrect in that assessment. So we are going to talk to Cory. Oh my god, Cory in the house. Except the, 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 it's this is the long-awaited sequel. Cory in the prison. Come on, get to the central cell block for morning assembly. You can't be later. You'll wind up in a punishment cell. We've made some new friends. You know, as you keep saying that, Mio, I don't think you know what it means. Oh, Jansen. And a nop on in the background. The infiltration went fine, but then all hell broke loose because, you know, no plan survives contact with the enemy, even though the enemy is a prison. It's hardly a surprise. Exactly. You, you know exactly what, what's going on, Jansen. Gondor's always been that way. Must be tough for poor Aggie and Augie. Are Aggie and Augie, you know, the soft, gentle-spoken types, and Gondor is like, oh, rough and tumble. Nisik, do you have any knowledge? If she'd have lost heart, I would have given her a good thrashing. But Gondor's Gondor, wherever she goes. I don't suppose, Napon, uh, Sima. We'll talk to Sima first. There were a lot of soldiers in this prison who I know well. It was devastating not knowing whether they were alive or dead, so it was a huge relief to see they're still alive. I know the mission here is to rescue Gondor, but I also want to make sure that we get everyone else home if we can. We will do absolutely everything in our power. Ruggy Scruggy, can you give me a rock? Can Ruggy Scruggy help friends? Shilshil asked us to collect stones. I don't suppose being thrown in jail has impeded you from collecting stones? What do you mean by had? What are you talking? Did you get rid? Did you sell your stones? Are is some prison prisoner buying stones for like a slingshot ammo? They could have just gone outside and got them. Ruggy Scruggy lost all of them during prison labor labor time. Prison labor times. Oh, why do I bother talking? Why do you bother listening to me talk if this is what you listen to? Ruggy Scruggy, not slacker like my mama. Like, yo mama try very, very hard to search, but too many scary people, so could not find. I see where this is going. Fine, we'll go on a stone hunt for you. That very helpful. Any color, okay? So bring back findings to Ruggy Scruggy. You know, I genuinely wasn't expecting a quest, even though that was the question mark on the on the minimap. Uh, oh, excuse me. Illicit caravan. Nothing for sale to friends here. Please jog on. Well, that was an easy 10... Affinity? We only have to talk to all of these people once. We get the lowdown and then we'll never have to speak. I always get sad in the lead up to the day of the eclipse. A spectacle of slaughter. I'd rather be dying in battle. Why did I have to get myself captured back we'll then? Because a lot of people have been in here for years, as, as they've said. The identification devices work pretty well, it seems. Just take care of the guard. Just take care of the guards don't see our little modifications. And drawing attention to yourself by interlinking is absolutely out of the question. Got it? Okay, yes, yes, I under I tried to use it against Gondor. I'm aware. 
Kirito, hello. The lost numbers locked up in the prison camp were all captured during mission they'd undertaken. They've remained here year after year after year with hardly a hope of getting out. And we had no idea what kind of life they've been leading here. Considering it's a prison... Fixie Fixie. What has Fixie Fixie done to be locked away with two people? Is this like the sick and infirm? That one's on the, the, the bed like they're sick and dying. It's only those two. I think Fixie Fixie has a disease. Did I talk to everyone? Brenda! Oh my god, hi Brenda. I knew a girl named Brenda once. They've really pulled the wool over these Agnian guards' eyes. Plenty of my comrades have been telling them Mobius are pulling the strings, but they won't believe a word of it. Make some new friends. They probably, uh... Beware of enemy attack. Is there, are you really giving beware of enemy attack advice here and now? Now's not the time. Who are you? Afton, Anton. You know where my brain is at. <laughs> I watch all the game theories. You'll see Gondor around the central cell block a lot. Just look for two burly dudes hanging around. I'm sure you won't miss them. We've made some new friends. Oh my god, more people. She's like, why is the, the objective 300 meters away? Oh, because we have a side quest. Right, side quests. Hard to uh, do side quests in prison. Burnell. Brunel. Ten long years ago I spent in... No, ten long years I spent in this prison camp. That's a humdinger of a stretch. It's probably about time they picked me out for the chop. What makes you think that? My age. You don't see many old prisoners in here, do you? We've made some new friends. Ten whole years, that's the entire, the entirety of a full term for Agony and Zincavesi. Ten years. Can you imagine for ten years in prison? Maybe. I don't know. I've never been to prison. I have never experienced prison riots. I'm sorry, there's so much on my plate right now. Like, prison riot? I really can't afford to help you guys out. Sure thing, could you spare us a few tips at the very least? Uh, yeah, maybe. There's a Nopon who got mixed up with the Green Pop here. Wait, what? Gen Pop. That doesn't make any more sense. That makes arguably less sense. Because if it was Green Pop, I could be like, Oh, you're from the weird places that call Soda Pop. Or the even weirder places that call it Soda Pop. And not just Pop and or Soda. Very strange people. If there's anything you need, that might be a way to get a hold of it. I need a gun. Wait, we have guns. We can summon guns at will. We all have access to Gray's class. Should probably do something with that at some point. Where is Gondor? Can we speak, Gondor? I'll tell you what we should all do. Not one frigging thing. We do nothing. If we just stay put here, and the city folk keep a low profile, no one has to die for small nuts. So that's your now. Penny finally drops. Aren't they going to execute you next month? So? It'll be ten people if that. They've got over a thousand locked up in here. It'll barely register. So? Life's not statistics. I'm saying if you stir shit like what Bitch Queen wants, you'll have a thousand lives on your conscience. <sighs> and also, you're gonna set the world to rights? Then what's that there on your arms? On your chests? And then there's the kitten. Little more than a month left. <sighs> you must be the most eager of the lot. That's enough! Huh. Just shut up about the world already! All this holier-than-thou crap! You're only doing it for yourselves! <sighs> you just fight out of self-pity. Flailing around thinking you can make a difference. <clears throat> when I see off lives, I do it with purpose. Mia. Just one more day, one more minute. You've no idea how many lives we've sent. All the friends we had, wishing they'd had more time. That was each and every day for us. But it was all we could do. It was all we had to believe in. Day in, day out. You are... an Offseer? A 
And when we finally made it to the city, I realized there was a whole different world out there. They're so lucky. I really thought that. I was astounded. Just by extending our years, life could be so different. I even saw the beginning of a new life. That tiny little hand that was grasping mine. I can understand why you want to protect that. If that's the now you speak of, we'd never kill that. Still, that's why we're trying to protect it for you. To save our friends. To build a future that would make us free. You've got about a month. That enough? For that? I don't know. My time might be up before our fight is truly over. There's probably not that much I can do. Mia. But I've got to try. I'll keep trying while my flame still flickers. And after that, Yeah, we got gotcha. you. We'll carry on your will. Right, Noah? Of course. I don't really want to imagine that. But there's just no running away from it. All we can do is move forward. We have to. That day, Guernica entrusted us with this power. And because of that, we made friends with former enemies. Believe us, your now is safe with us, as is the future. So, that's your argument? Oh. What's this? For the Cloud Keep. Where the real Queen of Agnes is taking her beauty sleep. You'll need that to get in. Kinda like a key. <gasps> this thing took a liking to... Uh, names? Noah. Mio. Noah and Mio. I'll remember that. Hmm, anyways. The doodad reacted to you two when you teamed up. I think it was probably like telling me to give it to you. Thank you. You're helping us now? Still hate the fact that Bitch Queen sent you. But hey, the what's name did pick you, so. And I did promise. Promise? In three days, Agnes will be holding a large scale training exercise on Daedle Isle. Of course, that means minimal security for us. That'll be our chance to escape. How, then? <laughs> well, the only way I know how. Am I right, you dead? Yeah! I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, the proverbial's gonna hit the fan. Them's the brakes. Take it or leave it. All right. In three days. Just do some prison things until then. Oh, uh, just try to keep in line, would ya? We don't want to draw attention. We'll keep that in mind. Oh, and a quick word of advice. Hmm? When all is lost, let them hear you roar. Got that? Hear us roar? All that power you wield? That's exactly what it was meant for. We're done today. Scuttle back to your hole, you rat bastards. If we keep crowding together like this, a nice Mr. Jailer might show up and rattle your empty heads together. No worries, we'll clear out. Ah, before you go, just uh, one more word to the wise. If you're gonna pretend to be model prisoners, you better put some effort into the jobs the guards give you. 
What kinds of jobs are they? Hmm. It's different depending on the day. Anyway, come here again in the morning. We'll be here. We have to wake up early. This is this is prison, Manana. There, there is no sunshines and rainbows where the only problems we have to deal with is, you know, Tyrkins robbing us when we could just go out and be like, oh, mushrooms. We have gotten our food back. Now we have to be like, oh, what is this tasteless sludge? Uh, the, <laughs> the woes of the imprisoned. Noah, would be good idea to sleep early today. Early to sleeping, early to waking. Right. The advice of Nopons is most sage indeed. More people to talk to. Oh, wait, no, that's just Gondor. We have talked to everyone else. Gondor, Gondor. Look at that, a real critical mass of weapon-grade assholes if I've ever saw one, seen one, saw one. Oh uh, boy, pardon? This was all Bitch Queen's idea, wasn't it? Don't be getting any ideas, will ya? Doesn't matter what kind of hotshots you guys think you are, if you're in here, you stick to the rules. Gondor, has your mother never washed your mouth out with soap? Not sure if Agnes or Kevas would even understand that reference, but uh, Izzard would, because Izzard's old. Izzard and Mio are about the same age, probably, methinks. And, like, you would think that Izzard is a lot older than Mio, based on nothing, but, like, Mio might honestly be older, which is a strange concept. Either way, we've got like we've got to work through three days of prison nonsense before we can escape. So this is day one, and we're we're going in into day day two. Let's not worry about anything. We just there's no time for anything else. There are no side quests in here. Do we have any snacks? It's prison. There are no snacks. I'm sorry to say we we have nothing. There we go. We can clean our clothes, but we cannot eat any, you know, beer nuts or whatever. Do we have anything to discuss? Can we discuss, um, Colony Mew's future? Shall we put our heads together I this? didn't actually intend to do this, but apparently we can. Fiona has snuck into the prison. Okay, this is kind of accidental. Hey everyone, there's something I wanted to talk to you all about. A lot of people in Colony Mew still seem worried, even though it's been liberated. What can I do to lift everyone's spirits again? You have any ideas? Hmm, I'm not surprised they're feeling shaken after a traumatic sequence of, of events like that. What about you, Fiona? Are, are you alright? You're not stre stressing yourself out unnecessarily, are you? I have to be okay. If I look like I'm down, everyone else will feel down as well. That definitely sounds like stressing yourself out to me. I know Tello said this already, but you can tell us anything, alright? There must be stuff that's too tough to discuss with people in the colony, and we are about as far away and secure from the people in the colony as one can get. How you managed to sneak in here, Fiona, is well beyond me. I was just going to mention that. Yeah, again, Noah, the, the fact that we're in prison is probably a topic that should be uh, talked about. You still haven't told us your colony, haven't told your colony about the consul's true identity, have you? I thought it'd be better to not tell them. Aw, Fifi. Besides, I just want to think about the future from now on. I want everyone to feel truly happy that we survive together, or excited for tomorrow. I want to bring those feelings back for everyone, to make their sadness disappear. Well then, isn't it obvious what you need to do? In Colony Mew, everyone works together as one. Isn't that what you all say? Why don't you try talking to the colony about what to do next, Fifi? I'm... Not sure how that would pan out. We can come with you if you want. Would you like that? Not right now, though, because again, prison. We are in prison. It would not be, it would be pretty, pretty difficult. Insanely difficult. Pretty much impossible to be, like, getting out. We really can't. <laughs> we can ask for Tao's cooperation as well, since he knows all about the situation. Ah, but one more thing. Is it okay if I call you Senny? Uh, who, me? Uh, sh sure, for sure, why not? I don't see anything wrong with it. Hey, how come only she gets a nickname? You want one too? How about... Mm, Lan Lan? Lan Lan? That suits you so well, Lan Lan. Guess you're Lan Lan now. You lot really wind me up. 
All right, all right, enough of the nicknames. Let's get started. Colony Mew needs us. I'm sure Tella will help us out. Um, as much as I would love to do this at the moment, it's an impossibility. I genuinely didn't think that they would allow us to even have that conversation. But evidently not. So, so <laughs> even in a place where there is only main story, I find a way to drag cutscenes into it. Can we go to bed now? We're really tired. Yeah, let's get some food on the go. There's no food to be had. I'm envious. Of what? You, Mimi, Noah, you're all so incredibly confident. Who's confident? It's all a big act. I don't know about Noah and Mio, but me though, I'm pathetic. Huh? I'm just acting tough to pump myself up like I'm not a wimp. You think you're a wimp? Yeah. I'm a lot like you. Huh? But look, what's wrong with that anyway? If we're weak, there's room to grow. Right? <sighs> Remember the first time you became Ouroboros? You yelled, Lance, come with me, huh? Hmm. You reached out for the strength you needed. Oh. Our friend Yorin, he became Mobius. But that, that wasn't him. That's his life's purpose? Like Spark it is. So I think, maybe I want to figure out the purpose of my own life. I want to get stronger. And if Yorin surpassed me, I'll get even stronger than that. Oh, wow. I won't be doing it for the recognition, nor to be liked. I'll do it for myself. Even if people don't recognize it, right? We're here. This is us. Let's keep being true to ourselves. What's wrong with that? Same old plans. Same old Senna. Never stop being you, okay? Recognizing your own purpose, huh? You mind if I pinch that mindset? What you talking about? Friends don't need to ask. Huh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Here's to us, the mighty weaklings. Is everyone ready? Time for day two of prison extravaganza. Gondor told us to go into the central cell block. It's about the same time now as it was when we infiltrated the prison. Uh, what if that foul mouth at jailer's there? He'll no doubt be at the morning gathering. I was about to say meeting. It's like, yes, time for the, the six o'clock meeting. All you need to do is come by. We, we run in a PowerPoint this morning. It'll be really quick in and out. It's like four slides. Just like a quick a quick uh, recap on uh, prison life. Don't expect, you know, privacy in the toilets, which, you know, you're all soldiers. Deal with it. The food is terrible. We are aware. We eat it too. Slide three is like, don't try and punch out your jailers, you will die. And then rule four is like, don't ask for an extra pillow, we don't have any. That's the, the four rules of prison. Let's go, my fellow model prisoners. Good luck at the hard labor, everyone. Oh, uh, hope we get off lately. We never will, because that is an impossible thing to ask for, Uni. Let's go see what our stupid, uh, more people to talk to. How, Anton, oh my god, it's Afton. Uh, don't make me build robots. The guards know we wouldn't stand for it if they laid a hand on Gondor, so they turned a blind eye to most stuff. Things have definitely gotten lively around here since Gondor arrived. We've got the daughter of the Elder with us now, and that gives us all some hope. Well, I'm glad... Don't tell me we've got to listen to another tedious speech. Oh, we probably do. Patience is golden. 
You know what else is golden senna? Showers. And that is not good because if you ever get showered on by a swan, that's how you end up preggers. So, yeah. Don't ever, don't ever agitate swans. Oh my god, the jailer. Look, he's has got a pointy mask. Good morning, prisoners. How are you this fine day? It's a good day to show gratitude to your jailers. We let you keep your criminal lives. Least you can do is work till you drop. Them won't do work, don't eat. And so, without further ado, here is your work details for today. Today's food gathering duty is the Perimeter Woodland. You're to team up based on your assigned cell. First, gather 20 each of car carnamels, gold burdocks, peachy truffles, and honey plums. Carnamiles. Carn. Carnomalies. I have. <laughs> it's like an anomaly, but you can drive it. It's. It's unknown. It's an unknown mobile anomaly. It's got five wheels, but where the fifth wheel lies, no one ever knows. Sounds like another breezy one today. Oh, for sure. Might even be able to sneak in a nap a root, don't you? And the reason why that guy is in prison is because he wor he uses words like nap a root in terms of, like, instead of naps. Like, that's the reason. He's the kind of guy who's just like, oh, nap a root. Time for a nappy doodle. And then he's, you know, like, passes out on the job and then he gets caught and I was like, oh, shucks. That's why he's in jail. And that's why no one likes him. I won't even, I don't want to even, if that's light, I don't want to even think about what a hard day looks like in here. What a bunch of whiners, all we have to do is collect things, that's literally all we do when we're outside of prison. What's wrong, Tyon? Those foodstuffs that the guard named, it's the exact same food that the castle distributes to us. Hey, does that mean the food the colonies receive is all picked here? Well, how many colonies are there? They, they need a lot of food. Is there, like, a lot of supplies out here? It would be the natural conclusion. So they're using the lost numbers as free labor. Well, slave labor, because, you know, it's not like they're free. That's why they're called slaves. We're now opening the gate to the perimeter woodland. Open, 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 open. It's been opened. Dun, 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 the gate is open. And no funny business, you hear me? Anyone acts suspicious, they get taken out. End of. Hard stop. Do not pass go. Do not collect your 200 ether crystals. You're dead. We have sniper rifles trained at you at all hours of the day. We're supposed to keep our heads down until we can execute the plan. Maybe, you know, step one is to not talk about the plan. Can we just, you know, like, make that a, a simple follow-through rule? It's like, we know what's happening, it's set, three days, don't talk about it anymore. It's like, maybe maybe, maybe not the, the smartest thing to be like, first day of prison. Oh my god, okay, fine, we'll do day one. We'll wrap up today with, uh, well, making friends. Wait, we can have prison? How old is prison warden? He is in term 10. He's got no friends, no allies, nothing. What a lonely existent prison warden. Existence, prison warden. Or let's go pick some things. Oh my god. Why do you people need to talk so much? Aggie, you've got some tremendous power locked away in there, haven't you? I wouldn't try using it while I'm prison duty, though. The guards are sure to find out. Yeah, yeah, we know. No interlinking. We got it. Augie. 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 Augie! What I wouldn't give for a taste of city cuisine right now. Don't go getting the wrong end of the stick, mind. I've got no regrets about following my lady. None at all. We need to get you a fedora, Augie. It's just every now and again I think of the food in the city and I'm like, Oh my god, it had real flavor. I forgot the taste of strawberries. Do they have strawberries in this reality? Who knows? Look at all of these things. We need to find 20 things. We found 
all of these plums. We will we will get every collectible. It is a very good thing that these collectibles have exclamation marks above them. Because that way, we can be like, oh, yes, we have a, a bunch of them. We have done this for like five minutes. You guys need to stop complaining about the gathering. We do so much more outside of prison. You've got nothing to complain about. Everything that we do here is perfectly acceptable and well within our range of skills. We do this for a living after all. Do you have any idea how much we do? Oh my god, Afton. Afton wants a quest. We have to repair Bonnie. Is that what prison work is always like? I, I really don't think this is the time to talk about the weather tie-on. We have to talk about, you know, picking food or mining for resources. Either way, a full hard day's label. La label. Labor. I really need to slow my speech so I can process the words. Here, have this. Are you sure? We don't want you too tired when the breakout happens, yeah? Thanks, this will definitely help. Eight honey plums. Well, Let's hope we can get them out without a hitch. I mean, t t to be fair, to credit the people, uh, it's not like we're, you know, strangers, strangers. They know that we're, like, Ouroboros, and, 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 and the fact that we're Ouroboros means, like, like, we're pretty, we're, like, not to toot our own horn or anything, but we're pretty important to the plan. I, I, I think that's, that, that's, that's not an unfair thing to say. And I mean, like, yeah, you want your strongest, most important people to be like, hmm, probably want them at, you know, full capacity. And if, you know, to get to full capacity, you have to be like, here, have some truffles. I, I, I think they'd be willing to be like, yeah, have my truffles. I wish I had some truffles. I could go for food. I'm really hungry. Who else is hungry? If you're hungry, uh, leave a comment saying, like, I would kill for X, Y, and Z. What is the, the, the food? What is the food that you'd kill for? I would love to know. If you're hungry and you would kill for, you know, a Klondike bar, just just put Klondike bars or pizza, like good pizza. What's everyone's favorite pizza? Oh, it's like pizza purist. I like cheese, just like cheese, cheese. You can't go wrong with cheese. Okay, we're done with honey plums. We didn't even have to talk to someone to get honey plums, I don't think. We're very close on the Carnomalies, and they will never be anything other than Carnomalies for me. Oh, beloved Spark, how can there still be more to do? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. You I'm genuinely... Get to it already. You're just dragging this out. I'm with Senna. Stop complaining, Lance. We do this so much. We need Burdock. We need Burdock root. How else are we going to feed our horses? Oh my god, Gory has a objective for us. Cory in the prison! Give me your knowledge, Cory. Did you guys grow these? Yeah, the soil's decent to begin with, so it wasn't too much of a hassle. But it does piss me off to think they're filling up the guard's stomach as well. Here, you guys can grab a few. It's those same gold burdocks they've had you picking. Ah, thank you so much. Can't quite believe I'll be seeing the back of this place in a few days. Stop talking about that. It's like we really need to stop talking about the fact that we're breaking out of prison in three days. Wish I could take this soil with me where I go. Oh, that's enough for the burdock. Incredible. And we're strong enough that we don't have to worry about fighting people. Oh, we don't have enough truffles. We only have five truffles. Six truffles. Seven truffles. Eight truffles. Nine whole truffles. Ah, ah, ah. Nine truffles. Ten truffles. Look at all of these truffles. Eleven. Twelve. 13, 14. To think this is how they keep the colonies fed. I honestly don't know how to feel. Neither do I. Probably, you know, oh, maybe Brenda, Brenda, please tell us how to feel about the fact that, you know, we're eating slave labor food. How long have you lived here? Not as long as I spent fighting before. I heard you lot are planning to escape. Stop mentioning that. Guess you'll be going back into battle. That's kind of impressive. Why? I haven't been here too long, but long enough to work out one thing. I was tired of having to fight for my life. Ugh, sorry, I didn't mean to keep you. It was just nice to have someone new to talk to. You still got more stuff to pick, right? Here you go, then. Good luck getting the rest. We don't need any carnomiles. Or car carnomalies. 
Where is there is a exclamation mark? I I knew there was a technically a question mark the instant I said like the, the X passed my tongue and I'm like oh it's a question mark and then I like I paused. Who dares? I do not desire. No, we are not fighting. Shut up. It's not happening. Leave us alone. Leave us alone. Ether? Can we have ether? I mean, I'm just, it's like next to useless for us because we're in prison, but we're up to 50 now. Oh, Dana. Dana. Da Danish. I wish I had a Danish. I'm hungry. What are you looking at? Probably looking for some food. Noting the guard's positions. I want to be of use when you're breaking out Gondor out of here. Again, stop mentioning the breakout. Right. Anyway, that's what I'm doing, and it served my purpose to be inconspicuous. Not to be rude, but could you go away? Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Do you? I don't suppose you have any uh, car anomalies, do you? Oh, hey, wait. Take these car anomalies. Whenever their prisoner's talking, it's a matter of time before guards show up. We don't want them twigging to our plans. Again, shut up about them then. PG Truffles. Oh, we finally finished. Let's get this report done. Doing this day after day would definitely get old. It took like five minutes. It's like, what, what time? How long did this actually take us? When did we come out? We came out probably like... Like less, like an hour? Like no more than an hour and a half, surely. It's like a, it's like minute differences. It's going up by the minutes. It, we probably came out at 10 o'clock and we're going back in at like 11.30. Stop whining. You're supposed to be brave little soldiers. We're going back to bed. We're going to bed before noon because, you know, whatever. Prison guard, here, have some truffles and burdock. We've collected our quota. Let me be the judge of that. All right, then. Here's the list for the next batch. We worked our asses off, and now you want more? You got a problem with that? Feel free to die if you prefer. We're keeping you alive out of the goodness of our bleeding hearts. You want to stay that way? You work, boy. What did you just... I called you a boy, boy. Chill out. Or do you want to get beat? We need to lay low until, you know... It's not a matter of just being vague, Noah. If you make references to, you know, we just gotta lay low until, <laughs> wink, wink, nudge, nudge, the guards will be like, what? And then we'll be like, nothing, nothing, and they'll be like, hmm, I'm sus. You're sus. Everything about this is sus. It's like, okay, fine, Noah, we can do other things. What are we doing? Right, that'll do it. Work's over for today. I guess we just went back out between that flash of black. Six hours later, we get our quota. Back to yourselves, you animals. 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 We're not the ones wearing helmets. Animals. We're going to bed. I want to go to bed. Ugh, I stink of dirt. And there's no showers here. We gotta stay patient. Just two more days. It's inconceivable. Is it though? Is it really? All the people here have had to do work like this day in, day out, every day for a decade or more. They're being seen as an expendable labor source. I imagine the overseers don't even consider them human. Mm -mm. We need to keep our strength up for tomorrow. Let's call it a night. Yeah, you're right. Calling it a night. I think that is an incredible idea, Noah, the first day of prison. We are going to wrap up this episode here. Day one. I think I had enough backbreaking labor to last me for a term or two. You picked roots. Kyle, are you feeling unwell? Should we head back to the cell and let you rest up for a bit? Roots and peaches. Truffles. Peachy truffles. The truffles were peachy. Die on. We have literally collect. I need. Okay. Okay, okay, you want to do this? You want to do this, Tyon? Items, items, all of this stuff we've looted. What can we loot? Fossils, 95 Nuppon coins, all of these shards, fossils, amber. Wait, we need, this needs to be by amount. No, why, why can't I sort by amount? That's insane. 
uh, uh, that's so stupid. I want to be able, uh, fine, 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 fine. 18 Napon coins. Uh, we've got pebbles. We've got, uh, 95 coins. Wait, this is in key items. That's why it's not helpful. Uh, collectibles. Peachy truffles, wasabi, we've got wasabi, more fossils, we, you know how heavy alexandrite is, or fossils are, and don't, and like, these are chromar fossils, my friend, chromars, if you remember from Xenoblade Chronicles 1, are giant person-sized lizards, do you have any idea how heavy a rock the size of a person is? Enough back-breaking work for a term or two, I think you're just a whining little boy today, Tyon. It's like, oh, the peaches. How am I going to get the peaches out of the dirt? Shut up. Shut up, Tyon. Shut up. We're going to bed. Wait, we're ending the episode. I got distracted with your whining. Ugh. I can't stand whiners, Tyon. Go to bed and then, like, cry yourself to sleep. Oh, the peaches. Oh, the peaches. Either way, Tyon's whininess notwithstanding. If you guys watched for 30 seconds or the entire thing, thank you so much for tuning in to us picking peaches and crying about it for the entirety of the episode. 30 seconds entire thing. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you in the next episode for day two of the prison saga. Later.